Good morning, Chris Good morning. Rossolo. Nice to have you. Yeah, thanks for having me. Well, yeah, thanks for inviting us to your beautiful neighborhood, yeah. Spring Garden. Tell me what is so wonderful about Spring Garden. Well, I think the, 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 the biggest draw uh, that, that brought my family here was really the affordability uh, compared to other cities right? Um, and the proximity to a lot of the amenities, both in the north side and downtown. Yes. Yeah. You guys are what, a bus ride away or a bicycle ride away? Yeah, we are. We, we utilize the trails, and, and my kids and I, and, and we'll go on the trails and ride downtown to Point Park. But, but um, we can walk pretty much everywhere, That's which, is, beautiful. which is great. Yeah. Well, where do you see Spring Garden in 25 years? Well, hopefully I, I'd like to see an increase in, in development, uh, responsible development. Mm -hmm. But... Um, uh, hopefully, uh, there's going to be more um, of a, a housing stock. Um, uh, a lot of the abandoned houses hopefully will be torn down, and, and uh, hopefully, we'll have some green spaces and more parks. Right, um, right. Yeah. So, do you find that Spring Garden is a diverse neighborhood, and in, in age-wise, uh, ethnicities? Do you find this a diverse neighborhood? I think so. Yeah. I mean, of course, I don't have a lot of the the data to back that up, but just from what I see, I know there's uh, a lot of longtime residents here mm -hmm. uh, who are still, you know, living here, uh, but also new families uh, coming in uh, of, of different ethnicities, uh, which which is good. It's we, we need more of that. If you were to have a friend come to visit you from out of town, what's the first place you'd take them here in Spring Garden? Probably the the Penn Brewery, I think, is a nice asset that we have. Um, you know, it's it's funny. There there are other uh, breweries and, and beer gardens opening up, uh, you know, throughout the city. But we we have the original one. You have the you original will. one. Yeah, very the one with great history. Yes, great it's a very history. Very old neighborhood. It is. It is. So. Yeah. Can you can you tell me something about some of uh, maybe the local landmarks other than the Penn Brewery and local heroes that might have come out here, even the unsung heroes. Well, I think um, it's not specifically in Spring Garden, but uh, the St. Anthony's Chapel up on Troy Hill. That's a nice um, historical, uh, significant landmark. Actually, my wife and I got married there. Oh, yeah. it's really it's special. Then. <laughs> yeah, it is very special. Uh, but um, as far as, as heroes, uh, you know, that's, that's, a, uh, that's a tough question. I don't, I'd have to get back to you on that one. Well, I don't know. Maybe your neighbors are. Do you have, do you have, you have a real sense of community in your neighborhood? We do. Um, you know, there, I, I can cite a good example. Uh, a couple weeks ago, one of our neighbors um, didn't show up for work, and uh, some of his colleagues were pretty concerned, and, and, and the police showed up to, to ask neighbors questions, and we sort of... Um, all communicated with one of another Beautiful. to see when the last time we saw um, our neighbor and, and we were able to, uh, you know, everything worked out and he's okay. But, Beautiful. But, but you guys stuck yeah, together like yeah, a community. Yeah, it is, yeah. It's beautiful. So it is, it's That's nice. Beautiful. Yeah. If you were to go to another neighborhood in Pittsburgh um, and you saw something about it uh, that inspired you, what neighborhood would that be and why? Um, I, I think all of our neighborhoods have, have great assets and, and um, I, I think, uh, you know, that, that I, I could cite a lot of examples of, of, of different mm -hmm. uh, landmarks or, or, or things that, that strike me as interesting and I, you know, will go back to. Um, you know, I think, um, I think, you know, our downtown neighborhood, uh, I think a lot of people look at all the other surrounding, you know, neighborhoods mm -hmm. from downtown, but, you know, downtown in my mind is still a neighborhood and I love going down to Point State Park and, um, you know, of course, uh, I, you know, the Strip District has, has a lot of neat things and again, that's in a, a walkable distance. And well, do you have a, do you, does Spring Garden have a library, um, a community center or is there places where you all congregate and do things within the community? Yeah, no, I think that would probably be uh, one of the things that we need to improve on. Mm -hmm. um, there are not uh, a lot of amenities here in Spring Garden. Um, you know, I think, again, I think technically it's um, on, in Troy Hill, but, you know, we like to take our kids up to the Spray Park, for example. And right. that, that, you know, you have a sense of community there. Beautiful. Uh, in the summertime, we like to go up there. But uh, in terms of, um, you know, a library, we, we utilize the one on Federal Street, which okay. is still on the north side, but it's not in Spring Garden. So. I think um, 
I don't know if, if it would be feasible to bring, right. you know, like this a, is like neighborhood yeah. more than a business district. Yeah, I think, um, you know, more of the commerce in the business district is on the other side of the highway on East Ohio. Does that fit? Does that work for Spring Garden? Um, I think it could um, if it had the businesses maybe that, that you know, we would like to utilize. Um, I think, um, I think there's a, a good mix of businesses on East Ohio, but um, you know, I think we can still improve. Uh, you know, uh, more coffee houses, restaurants, yeah, yeah uh, coffee shops, and yeah, art galleries. That's, that's right. right up my alley. <laughs> that's right. That's right. So, um, I think you know, I know for a fact if there was a, a coffee house or something like that, I would I would utilize you know the East Ohio corridor more. Beautiful, beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Chris, I want to thank you for thank inviting you, us Tracy. to your beautiful, beautiful neighborhood. Oh, thanks thank for having you so me. Much. Yeah.